Hello friends, welcome to Tutorials Point. In this video, we'll see exclude commands. So this is the agenda. We'll first see delete, then exclude, and then the show commands. To delete a lines from a data set, you need to write D in the line number area and press enter. If you write D, then only single line will be deleted. If you want to delete n number of lines, then you need to write D and in N you can place any number. Suppose if you want to delete five lines, you need to write D5, then the five lines will be deleted from that area. If you want to delete a block of lines, then you need to type DD in the starting and in the end where you want to delete, that block will be deleted completely once you hit enter. Now the next is exclude command. Exclude command is used to exclude lines from being displayed. Suppose in a file, if you do not want to display some lines, then this can be done using exclude command. This is similar like for a single line, Type X in the exclude in the line number area, that line will be excluded. If you want to exclude n number of lines, then you need to type X and give the number like 5 or 10, it will exclude 10 lines. And the next is exclude a block of lines. So to do that, um, in the starting, type XX, XX uh, in the end, type XX again, hit enter, that block will be excluded. Now, if you want to show the excluded lines, then you need to type S command. So to display the excluded lines again. So if you want to show one excluded line, type S. If you want to show n excluded lines, type SN. If you want to show first excluded line only, you need to type F. And if you want to show first n excluded lines, then again FN. In N, you can place any number like 5 or 10, whatever you want. And then if you want to show the last excluded line, type L in the line number area, hit enter. And if you want to show last n excluded lines, then you need to type L followed by the number. Now we'll see all these practically. We will see now how to use delete, exclude and show command. I'm opening the data set, PDS which we created in the last video. So I'm opening the first member reset to remove the warning message so we'll start with delete to delete a line type D in the line number and then press enter suppose if I want to delete fifth line I will write D in the line number area for the fifth line and then I will press enter so this is the fifth line I will write D here and I will press enter so line 5 has been deleted. If I want to delete a block of lines, then I need to select the block using DD. So I, I will write DD at the first line and then DD at the last line. So it will select the block and when I will press enter, it will delete the block of lines. So I'm going to delete from line number 3 to line number 6. So DD and here again DD. So I have selected this block. So when I will press enter, so lines 3, 4, 6, so they will be deleted. So lines have been deleted. We can delete in one more way by using DN. Here N is the number of lines which we want to delete. Suppose I want to delete two lines, then I can write D and 2. So it will delete two lines starting from here. So delete 1 and delete 2. So when I will press enter, so these two lines will be deleted. So you can see lines have been deleted. Now we will discuss about exclude command. Exclude command is used to exclude lines from being displayed. Like delete, we can exclude line or lines in three different ways. We can exclude a single line or we can exclude multiple lines or we can exclude a block of lines so I will start with the block I'm going to exclude four lines so from here um, uh, for exclude the keyword is X so you need to write X X and if I want to exclude these four lines so the block I have started from here fifth till 8th so I will press enter so 
from 5 to 8 the lines have been excluded it doesn't mean we have deleted them it's just they have been hidden so here you can see the message four lines no displayed so if I want to see these line again there is a command show command show command is used to show the hidden line if I want to display only one line then I will write S1 in the line area so let me write here so it needs to be written here so I will write S and then 1 so it will uh, it will unhide or it will show the first line here so this fifth line we can see this line now so three lines not displayed so it means three lines are still hidden suppose if I want to see the last line I can write L here when I will press enter it will show me the last line it will display the last line so when I will press enter I can see the line number eighth here you go so this is line number eighth so again now we have two hidden lines to show them we can write F2 so it means first two or last two because we have only two lines so here you go you can see all the lines now also if we reset it we can again see all the lines reset command you remember which is used to hide the warning message so let me show you suppose if I exclude from here X four lines so I'm using x n method so n can take any value so I'm excluding four lines x4 so four line are, lines are not displayed so if I write a reset res it will display all the lines you can exclude the lines based on the conditions x as well suppose if you want to exclude all lines which has number 2 in it then for that you need to type a command here in the command line x all 2 so it means exclude all lines which have 2 as a value in the line so here you go so here one line is not displayed because uh, the second number was there again it was having second number so one line is not displayed so if I want to see all the lines again then go to home and do a reset so this is all about delete exclude and show commands in the next video I will show you more commands which are related to movement of data or moving or copying members in PDS etc